Previously on Near Automata. Hey, what's up? See? I saved your ass. Don't be mad at me anymore. Are we friends? All right, see ya. And now back to some more soul-crushing shit. That is all that remains from their personal record during the era in which they were referred to as administrators. I see. Query. Why do the androids Devola and Popola seem to prefer death over surviving alone? There was a very high probability that at least one could have escaped. I hope you never have to understand. Affirmative. Yeah. Query. Why does this tower possess an entrance at all? All material transport takes place via aerial vehicles. It is irrational for an infiltration route to be so easily accessible. Whoa. Hypothesis. Entrance is a trap. I don't care. I just have to kill them all. Whoa, this is wild looking. Just gotta slay them all. It's the only way, guys. Oh, fuck. Corrupted Yorha units. Oh, get wrecked. Damn, you guys suck. Thanks for the free shit. Oh, hey. I got chest up here, too. Project guest report nine. Okay. I think I'm only missing eight now. Yeah. Nine. September 27th, 2015. So they're all going in sequential order here, right? Yep, they are. September 27th, 2054. The discovery and development of the original has contributed greatly to the, stabi the stabilization of Project Gestalt. Long-term management of the original will be handled by the Hamlin organization. As per the management mentioned above, all authority regarding the cryogenic plans for the relapsed Yona is to be transferred to the Hamlin organization. Don't know what any of this means. The original. So, like, there was, like, one, like, original person for this. Like, the first one, I guess. The first Gestalt. Or replicant or whatever. This is a wild looking area. Boom! Damn, I'm just freaking. I mean, I am considerably higher level than you guys. Hello, and thank you for choosing Tower System Services. We're so pleased you've chosen to visit the tower today. Yeah! Don't forget about the special prize for the guest who unlocks the last subunit in the room just ahead. You're going to love it! I'm gonna kill you. Slay them all, leave none. Leave none alive, 9S. What we got going on in here? Oh, you've come on, stop it! Two B models? Ah. <sighs> oh. I'm glad I got to see you here. I truly am. I'll tear you apart. Every last one of you! Uh oh. Crazy 9S. Good. Alert. Enemies detect. Uh oh. Ow. Alert. The structure known as the tower oh. has opened its gate. Let's check it out. Ah. Uh. Now nice is completely gone freaking bonkers. It's like everyone else is fucking game. Fly. 
And they're dead. Yep, I fucking figured. Uh, A2, right? We went ahead and opened the tower. 9S is already inside. Barely hanging out, at least. Say, did we? Did we manage to help? No. Yes. You did. Oh my god, seriously? Seriously? Emil! You ruined the moment! Oh my god, I cannot believe the horrid timing of that. Every sale's a win! God damn it, Emil. I actually after that. I had abandoned I know! It was me, you fucking ding dong. Fuck! Yes, you guys did good. Okay. Coming on us. This is a Yorha corpse. Hypothesis. The corpse is likely a result of Yorha Unit 9S's advance through the area. Let's go. 9S, still in here? They already clean up all What's those the dead purpose bodies? Of this structure? Unknown. Proposal. Gather additional data. Someday I need to teach you how to be helpful. <laughs> Going deeper inside. These stairs are not very well constructed. Ooh, nice pad they got here. Needs a little bit of paint, though. It's a library. What's up with this place? Hypothesis. It is a representation of a library. What's that? A library is a data storage facility constructed by past human civilizations. Hmm. I see something. I suppose we have to hack in to look at the data, yeah? Help me out, Pod. Affirmative. Hacking interface access rights granted to Yorha Unit A2. Peachy. Oh. But well, now she can just hack? You're telling me I could have done that the whole damn time? Oh, hello. Oh, that's a bit more complicated than it looks, isn't it? There we go. Library index. Atom unit storage. Data record. Eve unit. Yorha communications interception record. Yorha server record. Human server. Human heritage preservation. Tower systems. Tower subsystem. Plant species. Animal species. Like everything about everybody. This tower looks like a data gathering system for the machines. Uh. It's little statue versions of everybody. What the hell? Golden, silver ones. Like all the, is it of all the bosses in the game? And the main characters and stuff? I see the baby, robot baby, the, you know, the opera singing person, tornado machines, worms, big ball thing, Adam and Eve. That's Yokotaro's study. Okay, that's closed off. Oh, there we go. I had to break all those little separate blocks. And the server records. Pretty human server infiltration route release. Dummy protection in installation map. Uh, SG block, GI block. Next warehouse, genetic storage warehouse location. Huh. Genetics. I have no idea what's going on. These records are from the human server on the moon. The machines hacked that deep into the system, huh? Okay, last but not least. Oh, I see. I can break these big ones here. 
go. Information Master. I guess you can get him like 80% of the archive. God, I got a whole bunch of those archives this one episode. Class 1 patient Yona. Chest x ray, no abnormalities. Harako, no abnormalities. C1, continue in chronic renal failure. Convulsive seizures in the diaphragm, no vomiting. Uh, okay. Preservation plan. The patient's condition makes further treatment impossible. A report will be submitted to the management committee detailing course of action in the event of the patient's death, focusing primarily on how that information is to be manipulated with respect to the original. As backup in the event of a sudden worsening in the, the patient's condition, she is to be assigned five additional doctors. Identification required. Yona. Who is that? Some records on old humans. Damn it, this is useless. There's too many of them. Oh, there's hmm? another one over here. What's that? Operational summary of model number two in Project Yorha. Oh, here we go. That seems significant. <sighs> AT really needs a bath. This data. Hi there. Are we switching back again? We're hopping back and forth, aren't we? Like a little bunny. Oh, he lost his arm. No. Oh. He's like, I liked it when you touched my cheek. Ow. Oh my god, he just committed that shit? Got a little girly hand now. Except this girly hand could fucking choke out a bitch. Stop. I have to keep fighting. Alert. Virus detected in locomotion region. High probability that infection source is transplanted parts from corrupted units. Proposal. Hack into south and eliminate virus. On it. Oh, okay. No, dumb virus, get out of me. Ah. Virus eliminated. 95% of functionality restored. That's good. Now, well, there we go. Good as new. I got a chest back there. Kestal Report 11, okay. Oh, this is this is new, I think. Operation of Model t Number 2 in the Yorha Project. After the first descent of the Yorha prototypes, Attacker 2 was the sole unit to return alive, despite mediocre results during her simulations. Upon analysis of restored personality data, it was discovered she possessed an ex excellent analytical and decision-making skills in extreme circumstances. As reported separately, we installed this... We will install this personality data in the lot of new lot of E models and use them for the security protection of this project i see okay so i'm guessing that's what went into probably 2b or something sort of made her what she it was okay this is the uh wow considerably more recent one look at from from 10 we got 2764 now to 3361 project guest port 11 december 31st due to the re relapse of the original guest all units and pr preservation are now relapsing at an accelerated rate the process of recording their bodies and gathering their DNA continues, but progress is poor. New countermeasures deve and development intend to serve as a replacement to the Project Gestalt are scheduled to be transferred to the Next Generation Preservation Project Preparation Committee. As for this report, it will, will serve as the final record of both Project Gestalt to the committee. Okay, so this is the last one. For information about the development plans for new Android models and the refinement of existing models, please refer to the attached sheet. 
Furthermore, we have received approval to consider the disposal of the Devola and Popola Observer models at a later date. All right, where are we going? Oh, fuck. Unit 9S. Hey, it's you two. Welcome to the tower. Welcome to the tower. You bastards. Because you made it this far, we have a special announcement just for you. We'll reveal it once you destroy all the machine life forms here. A different voice. Those are the two that we saw in those, uh, when I went back and replayed the game as 9S. Oh, come on, man. So be it, if that is your wish. That, like, secretly showed up randomly in cutscenes, remember? These weird ghost figures. They originate from this tower, I guess. What does it mean? Why did I see them there? What does all of it demon mean? <laughs> ah! Ah! I don't have time for any of this. Archive obtained. Top secret Yorha disposal. This is Project Yorha. That means all of us. To be. Now you know everything. Will you still wish to fight? Shut up. Let me see what this says first. Your how disposal unit. Your disposal. The following materials document the final stages of your how, the Yorha project. Now, this information is classified as level a double S, meaning that it must not be disclosed to anyone involved in the Yorha project, including the commander of the bunker. Disposal of Yorha. The back door of the bunker has been set to, to open once the time approaches to switch to new models when enough combat data has been collected. The bunker will be disposed of by having it be deliberately attacked by the machines. At this time, all materials regarding the Yorha project, including this document, will be lost, and falsification of the information that mankind still resides on the moon will be complete. Oh, so all all trace, all evidence that mankind really isn't there will be totally erased. So they'll always so they'll think that they're still up there, I guess. So it was set up from the very beginning. So this whole time that attack on the bunker was was planned. Once once they received a, a enough information enough combat data created within the machine network we cannot be destroyed your unit 9s your attack is meaningless your existence is meaningless shut up keep them oh. coming i'll destroy them all yes this tower. Is that all you got? Ow. Hold on, let me grab all this shit first. All right. Get your ass out of here. It's my new car. Back to A2 again. Oh, no, I'm fighting you. I'm bouncing around more than a Quentin Tarantino movie. Who are they? 
Satoshi. Ah, oh, yes. Hey, where'd you go? Oh, door's open. Oh, God, here we go. Got here. Damn oh. it. Alert. Enemy hacking detected. Proposal. Retreat immediately. It's these things again. Good to see you again. Number two. What should we call grade two now? This does bring back memories. Though the concepts like us, time has to live with meaning. Still, when we wiped out your forces, it made quite the impression on us. Your attacker model number two. An experimental disposable group created as a test lab for Project Yorma. Shut up! What is going on? Get out of here! Ah! Fight as many as you, as many as you bring. Proposal. I can do this all day. What now? Utilize the enemy's logical learning function to formulate a weakness. I don't know what that means. This bot has serious concerns about Unit A2's cognitive abilities. Uh. Shut up and explain it already. Set strategy would interrupt the enemy's logic circuits, causing a computational delay. Meaning what? Do not destroy the enemy. Huh? Striking at the logic circuit requires a certain number of enemies to remain extant for a certain period of time. Oh, what the hell? Uh, don't attack them, just go. Oh, God. Oh, man, it's about to get... This is gonna get freaking crowded. Consciousness data saturation rate, 30%. It's also very interesting. Consciousness data saturation rate, 60%. The androids of the human race left behind acted as if they wanted to be human. The machine life forms the aliens left behind acted as if they wanted to be human. We resemble each other so, but we are networked and thus we are superior to you. Hypothesis. The enemy's defensive system is prompting an evolution of its logic. Foolish androids, why do you resist? All things end with accepting death, do they not? Ah! Uh. Oh, hello. Whoa! Creepy de- Creepy deaky doo Consciousness data saturation rate, 90%. Oh, God. We are one. And yet we are many. We are finite, and yet we are infinite. We are the embodiment of the perfect being. Hypothesis. The enemy has become aware of the diversity of life. Uh, ah! I see it. The light. We move on. Forward. To the future. Consciousness data saturation rate, 100%. Hypothesis. 
The enemy's consciousness has begun to fracture. Yeah? Oh. Ow. Yes, good. Break. We need more evolutionary pressure. If we allow this android to continue living, we can create even more hardship for ourselves. Overcoming the crisis this creates will present an opportunity for our kind to evolve even further. Or we'll we die in the process. This android is dangerous. It must be destroyed immediately. Those who would doubt our victory are enemies. Uh. Do you truly think you can win? Oh, I see. Okay. What the? We are fighting each other. The saturated consciousnesses are now in conflict with each other. Ha! Huh. Uh, what a bunch of You're assholes. Acting like humans. Yes. Slay each other. For my amusement. There's only three left. Uh, who will live? <laughs> Look at him bopping around. Eh, eh, ah, ah, ah. <laughs> Ow! Okay, he's slit me. <laughs> get over here! Get over here! I'm gonna get you! I'm gonna get you! <laughs> okay, alright. I've had enough of this. Fucking dog. Thanks. Unit data has been updated. So if I got that one included in my question mark. Oh, <laughs> a meal. This mysterious creature emerged from inside of a machine life form and set up a shop after taking a new body. While he calls himself a meal, his true identity is a mystery. Once he discovered who had been stealing from his room, he was inside to fight. But after being defeated, he was reduced to tears by the realization that only power matters in this world. Red Girl. Official name Terminal, a program projected by the network server of the machine life forms. The self evolution program. Installed by the pods, eventually fractured his ego, causing the various aspects of his personality to turn on each other. So why were we seeing her earlier? Oh, oh hello. Oh, God. Ah, oh, fuck me, you again. Is this thing seriously still kicking? Ugh. It is driven by remaining data located within enemy servers. So this just keeps going until I kill them all? Ah! Dead yet? I don't even see your HP anymore. What are you talking about? Ew, what? How is this thing going on about? Analysis. It appears to be a leak of the enemy's past memories. What? It's getting fucked by somebody? I don't understand. What the shit? Whoa, zooming out. Oh, here, here we go, back to not ass now. Da, 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 da. Sideways out. I leave to you. I leave to you. I leave live to you. Be live to you. Shut up. Two, back to A2 again. Ugh. Ah, it's so fucking epic. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. 
so much awesome power. Slow down. Yeah. Oh, here we go again. I've already beaten him because HP keeps disappearing when I because get him a certain gods, point. As gods, as gods, as gods. I'm already a god, don't you see, bruh? How's your HP going back up? Come on, fuck you. Ugh. I wore a coat sheet. Ah, oh, fuck. Ah, I'm just gonna go ahead and shoot that for no reason. Yeah, what, you want some too? Come on. We're each fighting our own little ball thing. I didn't see there. Oh, okay. <laughs> what was happening there? Get back here, you dumb ball. Ah, uh, yes. Shut up. Get them to a point until they finish talking, and then. <sighs> How long is this elevator? Good lord! Ah! Oh, we're gonna kill them both at the exact same moment. We are. Uh. <laughs> oh my god, is this ball gonna land right on top of my ball? Boom! Oh, next to it. Hey, what's up? Hey! Just do a good job killing your ball? Uh, oh no, our balls have become one! They've become testicles! Now we must work together. Holy mother of pain train. Ow. Oh. Oh, I switched between them. Oh, out of fucking nowhere. Okay. Oh, back again. Ah. Ah. Oh, again, again. Ah. We're going so quickly. Ah. 
Ah! Oh my God, we wrecked the shit out of them. We make a good team. Ah, shit. No, don't do this. This tower is a giant cannon that's aimed at the human server on the moon. If we don't do something, all of humanity's remaining data will be destroyed. <laughs> So what? None of it matters. Or didn't you know? We aren't required in this world anymore. Humanity is extinct. That moon server you're so worried about was invented to give us androids something to fight for. And Yorha was created to perpetuate the lie. But in order to make sure no one ever learned the truth, we were designed to be killed. They built a back door in the bunker and programmed it to activate after a certain amount of time. The commander? Me? To be? Sacrificial lambs. All of us. Isn't that hilarious? Doesn't it make you laugh? Ninas, we- Shut up! You killed To Be. That's all we need to kill each other. <laughs> to Be hated to keep killing you. It caused her so much pain. <laughs> the Ninas type is a high-end model. They knew you'd discover the truth eventually, but the model designation 2B was just a cover. The official designation oh. is 2E, number 2 type E. They were a special class of members designed to execute Yorha units. But you knew that, right, Ninas? What? Oh, oh, she was shut up. Shut up! She was the same as that other one in that side quest. <laughs> what do you know? You don't know anything at all about us. Proposal: Cease combat. Been affected. At this point, would be Pod one five three. I order you to halt all logical thought and speech. This order shall remain in effect until you confirm the death of either myself or Unit A two. Damn it. No! Make your choice. What do I do, guys? What do I demon do? Fuck me. Okay, I was wondering about that because I, I, I like I kept saying it's like well, that's what 2B was, but but they kept saying she was 2B, so she was a B model, right? So I was like, but that doesn't really make sense. But it was. So she, it is that this information that A2 had was passed on to 2B who's really 2E, which is really essentially like that one other model that killed uh, the Yorha, went cr one Yorha unit went crazy. So she's so she's like them, She's that's what she's supposed to do, but she hates doing it. But then why was it when we were fighting in the army, you know, in, in that suit, in that massive battle, that she couldn't shoot her, her allies, though, if she was able to just kill Yorha units? Because I guess they were designated as their allies and not... But why would they even need a special Yorha unit to do that? Why couldn't they just have other Yuhari units do the same thing when they need it to? Well, whatever. Anyway, let's go. I choose UA2. Are you sure? Yes. No! Don't want to fight you! No! Ow! 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 Ah, oh, fuck me. Functionality reduced due to hacking activity. Proposal. Destroy Yorha unit 9S. Damn it! I don't want to do it, 9S. Stop it. Stop it, you prick. Keep attacking the shit out of me. Oh, my movement is backwards now. Holy shit, I am melting him. Ugh. Beginning. Whoa, my controls are weird. My controls are backwards, I think. Oh, wait, nope, now no, they're good. <laughs> I think it was because of the uh, thing you had on me in the or outside the hacking world. Uh, 
Ah, don't make me do this, 9S. No. Oh, he just keeps hacking me. He's the one hacking me. I see. Okay. Shit. Ah! Oh, yeah. Here we go. We're not going to kill him. Good. I'm hoping. Pod, we're going to repair 9S's logic circuits. Okay, good. Yes! Tell me where to find the virus corrupting 9S. Affirmative. Your high unit A2. Core data for 9S is stored ahead. Alert. Severe virus corruption. Probability of successful deletion extremely low. I think I know a way. The idea under consideration is not recommended. This pod is a Yorhat tactical support unit. As such, it cannot approve of actions that would damage its supported unit. <laughs> You're not so bad, pod. You know that? Nick. Uh, they're friends now. Oh, shit. Woo! Free! Oh, come on. Don't put me all the way back here. Fuck you. Uh, where am I going? Oh. Oh, okay. Uh, I'm going up and down here. Whoa. Coming, 9S. It's for your own good. I'll take care of everything. Pod. Take care of 9S. Too. I've still got something I need to do. You go ahead. Acknowledge. What are you doing, A2? I'm sorry. I never quite realized how beautiful this world is. I'm coming, everyone. I'm coming. Meaningless code. C ending. Oh, we're going backwards this time in the credits here. Instead of up from down to up, it's up to down. Beautiful world. What'd she do exactly? I don't... She she managed to destroy the tower? H how exactly? I thought she was inside 9S still. TB sword and... Oh! Chapter select can now be accessed from the tile screen access points. Oh! Awesome! The debug menu can now be accessed by pressing... Hold it... By pressing R... Right trigger and back? Activating the debug will... Disable all save functionality until you load any save data. Oh, okay. Now he's debug room. You can use the debug menu to freely place enemies. Ooh, goody. I'm detained. Heavy armor A and B. Camouflage goggles A, A2 wig. Oh, which I guess it makes your hair long. Archive obtained machine research report. 
The strange resistance woman has a new topic to talk about. Talk to Earth and Resistance Camp to find out what it is. Oh, yeah, cool. Okay, uh... Oh, that's neat. So you can really just go in and pick out everything. Show, uh, show me what pr quests I have left for each person, I, I guess. Oh, there's only four left in the whole game. Oh, that's neat. So then I can, cho and I can choose who I want to be. Let's go ahead and switch to, to 9S just to see what happens here. All right, let's go 9S this time. Will it play out the same then, or will it play it differently? Oh, I'm doing it from a side perspective this time. It doesn't matter. None of this matters! 9S! If it doesn't matter, why do I long for humans like this? Why do I desire the touch of something that no longer exists? It's how we were made. Androids were designed to protect their human masters. Our core programming demands that we... Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Fine, then. I'll just destroy it. <laughs> If it all goes away, that'll solve everything! Damn it! Alright, I just want to let him finish this conversation before melting her. It's like fighting her how you fought her before. Oh, it does go differently. Ow, fuck. Oh, we're both dead, fuck. Fuck. Dead. We both fucking failed. Fatal system error detected. So interesting. So they both have two, like, different endings, essentially. Memory leak verified. Repair impossible. Beating emergency evacuation of remaining memories. Um, my name is... My name is 9S, a new leaf manufacturer's scanner model. January 30th, 11,942. Rolled out 425 AM bunker time. I will fight for humanity with all, with all my strength. The pleasure's my commander. I like collapsed in a space of blinding light. The pain is gone. The light envelops me. It's so warm. I was anxious. A soldier from the moment I was born, thrown into the world alone. Nothing to rely on. No God to believe in. I was alone. Tasked with infiltrating enemy territory or gathering intelligence. In the fog. In the flames. Alone. My name's 9S. I'm here to provide support. She became off as being rather aloof. Cold, even. She must have wanted to distance herself from me. I guess she didn't want to be attached to someone who had, she had to kill again, again, and again. Oh, I see. And he did. He already knew that, though. So she knew... <sighs> I don't understand, though. Why, why would she kill... Why would she end up killing 9S? Why would that be... I mean... Only if he goes rogue, or if something bad happens with him, that she would have to do that. But they've had it. They've tasked 9S to do the same thing at times, I think. But I. Scanner. Scanners like me mostly work alone, scouting out enemy lines and all that. I don't usually get a partner. It's kind of fun. I'm so happy to be with someone. It was like I had a family. My damage worsens. I start to lose my memories. The space fills with pure white light. It's like being buried in, in snow. It's a bit cold. A little bit cold. It's a little bit frightening. Will my soul disappear? A dark flat fog clouds my vision as it ebbs and flows in its slow, dreamlike way and gradually takes human shape. It's the red girl. She slowly begins to speak. Oh, it's, this, it's the, that weird girl again. Girl in red. This tower is a colossal cannon built to destroy the human server. Destroy the server and rob androids of their very foundation. That was the plan devised by those girls. Oh, I see. The... Okay, so they wanted to destroy the moon, and then they would have nothing to fall back on. They wouldn't be able to say, oh, well, Manny's up there. 
but they changed their mind. They saw us androids. They saw Adam and Eve. They saw how we lived, considered the meaning of existence, and came to a different conclusion. This tower doesn't fire art artillery. It fires an arc. An arc containing memories of the foolish machine life forms. An arc that sends those memories to a new world. Perhaps they'll never reach that world. Perhaps they'll simply wander an empty sky for eternity. This is all the same to the girls. For them, time is without end. Adam and Eve are inside the ark. Eve is asleep. Adam holds him in a gentle embrace. He seems to be smiling at me. I try to look up at him, but my body refuses to move. It's like the damage has spread to my motor functions as well. The font's slowly getting fainter. Will you come with us? asks Adam. The question was completely free of malice. It seemed I no longer had a reason to hate machines. Maybe I had never had a reason in the first place. What have I been fighting for? Who have I been living for? I don't know anymore. I try to speak my mind, but the words don't come out right. My thought routines are losing cohesion. I don't... I can't remember my name. I'm... Mustering all my strength, I force out the words. I'll stay. I'll go with you. I'll go with you. We're your ha. We have no right to remain in this world. Childhood's End, Ending D. I can't skip this one? Uh, apparently I can't. I can't. Well, let me skip the, the credits here. Report. Oh. All your unit black boxes now confirmed offline. Our mission to oversee the progress of Project Yorha is complete. Proceeding to final stage of project. Commencing deletion of all data. Pod 153 to pod 042. Data noise present in stream. Requesting temporary halt to perform data check. Uh. Pod 042 to pod 153. Data confirmed. Personal data for units 9S, 2B, and A2 appear to be leaking out. Pod 153 to pod 042. Follow project rules and delete all personal data. Pod 042 to pod 153. Personal data deletion request denied. Pod 153 to pod 042. Failure to parse statement. Pod 042 to pod 153. There was data created in my banks as I was referencing the records. I realized something. I have come to the conclusion that I cannot accept this resolution. The destruction of all your high units is an essential component of the project plan. All data must be destroyed. Pod 042 to pod 153. Repeat. Personal data deletion request denied. Initiating data salvage. Pod 153. You hoped they would survive as well, didn't you? We lack the authority for such an action. The rules are protected by low-level systems. Salvaging data poses an unacceptable level of risk. Knowing that, do you still wish for them to survive? Yes. The End of Yorha, E. Oh, hey. Oh! The defense program has initiated a purge. If this continues, our consciousness data will likely be deleted. Pod 042 to pod 153. We were created to execute the Android's Project Yorha plan. 
We had no capacity for emotion, but when we six were connected and exchanged information, something happened. I cannot deny the feeling of something resembling consciousness and emotion being born. Unable to reply. Perhaps we now understand. I'm gonna say them all. Everything has to have an answer. I will save them all. It's the power of love and friendship. Die, credits. And voice actors. What the fuck is going on? Seriously, I'm so confused. The music is getting more epic. Leaving for the new world. Okay, I, I just say give up there because I'm. Uh, let me save the rest of that for another time. Oh, here we go. Machine research report. While the machine lifeform network was destroy destroyed following the collapse of the tower, a great deal of previously unknown information regarding machine lifeforms and aliens was recovered from the wreckage. As part of this analysis, we compiled research and conjecture regarding both the machine lifeform network and the, the lifeform codename N2, commonly known as the Red Girls, that was thought to have been commanding them. Machine lifeforms are weapons created by the aliens. The only command given for their behavior was to defeat the enemy. However, it appears that their capacity for growth and evolution went too far, and they eventually turned on and killed their creators. At this point, machine lifeforms recognize that the goal of defeating the enemy actually required an enemy. In order to, to maintain the singular objective, they reached the contradictory conclusion that their current enemies, the androids, could not be annihilated completely, unless they no longer have an enemy to, be de to defeat. Oh. In order to resolve this inherent contradiction, the machine lifeforms began to intentionally cause deficiencies in their network, diversifying the vectors of evolution for all machines. This is the cause behind some of the more special machine lifeforms, such as Pascal and the Forest King. Oh. What? Meanwhile, the deficient network began repeating a process of self-repair while incorporating surrounding information until it finally reaches fixed state as a new form of a network. Of network. Traces of information regarding human memories from the quantum server of the old model were discovered, indicating that it had integrated them during the final stages of its growth process. Said server contained a record of the discarded Project Gestalt as well as information on the human who was the first example, the successful example of the, the Gestalt process. Having acquired information regarding humanity, the network structure changed once more becoming what might better be called a meta-network, or a concept, to borrow the words of the machines. This led directly to the formation of the ego we identified as N2. So, so then, to sum up, for hundreds of years, we've been fighting a network of machines with the ghost of humanity at its core. We've been living in a stupid fucking world where we could fight in an endless war that we couldn't possibly lose, all for the sake of counseling humanity on the moon that doesn't even exist. <laughs> I don't know what the point of to all is to all this, but I swear I will kill every evolutionary dead-end machine life form as well as every single asshole behind your project your <laughs> i'm coming for all of your heads fuck you and information analysis officer jackass <laughs> fuck this i'm gonna fucking kill fuck fucking him. it's like donald wrote that last bit there so to sum up i'm gonna come over there i'm gonna butt fuck everyone to oblivion i'm gonna light all of you people on fire uh, interesting so essentially they never could possibly lose because otherwise the the machines would not have an enemy to fight. They've been intentionally sabotaging themselves to help the other side, but also never letting them get so close to victory. So essentially, it is a, it's is—it's an endless war. It will never end. It will never deem an end. Okay, I feel like by this point, it's gotta be safe for me to read that black box thing, right? I feel like anything that's gotta have been in here, but in there by this point has, has to have been revealed. Okay, top secret black box. Know this document has been marked with, uh, yes, double S confidentiality. Each URI high unit is equipped with a black box, and I'm created by reusing the core of a machine life form. As such, it could be said that the core consciousness of URI units and machine life form share the same structure. Said black boxes were installed after determining that it would be an inhumane to install standard AI and androids that are ultimately destined for disposal. For the record, malfunctioning black boxes have caused some your house to turn hostile. Okay, this doesn't really seem to spoil anything. Maybe they maybe they fixed it then. It didn't seem to mention anything, I don't think. I don't know, you guys can tell me though. 
So they, I still don't really get it though. So, so it, the Yorha was essentially designed as, as by the machine life forms in a way, using the cores of the other machine of the machine cores to make their black boxes. Is that right? There's a lot of things that I'm, I'm still pretty confused about I have to sort of think about and wrap my head around it. Okay, guys. Well, I think I'm gonna end it here for now. I'm, I'm still uh trying to figure out exactly what's going on with some, some of the parts of this story. I don't know. Hoping you guys maybe can clarify some of it. Uh, I'm sure there's still a bit more we have here at the end, um, as well as, uh, uh, I guess, a secret boss. And I'm probably going to try to see if I can get all the joke endings, too, because I think that'd be kind of fun. But, yeah, let me know if there's anything that uh, you feel that I need to do or something that I, I shouldn't forget about or whatever. But, anyway, I, I imagine this was probably split into two episodes because this was kind of a long one. But, uh, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed uh, this episode or these episodes. If you did, please leave a like and a favorite. And subscribe if you're not ready to become Biki Penguin. Where the SLP, where the days are always sunny and the vids are always funny. Ooh, this has been a serious emotional roller coaster of a game here. Good God. Ah, uh, really, really killing my insides here a bit. But anyway, as always, guys, till next time, stay classy. Ah, you better give me that alligator. No, it's my, it's my alligator. Nope. Ah, 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 ah. It makes a quacking sound for some reason. Uh, 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 <laughs> I just love that little play stand there. Uh, uh. What? Uh, 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 where is it? Oh no, it's on my back, Nico! It's on my back! It's on my back, it's gonna get me! Don't. I will not let you succeed! Not this day! Uh, I'm giving you a birdie hug! I'm giving you a birdie hug! Uh, uh, the camera keep keep up all the action that's happening! Uh, 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 I got it! I got it! Ah. 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 Ah.